Hi guys, today's topic is how to choose a topic for your master's thesis. When you're pursuing a degree, whether it's master's, bachelor's, or even PhD in engineering, one of the key decisions you have to make is what thesis topic you should choose. Now, depending on your future plans, whether you want to start looking for jobs straight away after the degree, or if you want to continue with your studies, for example, a postgraduate degree, a master's thesis topic can help you determine what direction you want to take in your future. One of the things you need to remember is that if your thesis is in the field of engineering, the success of your master's thesis or bachelor's thesis is not based on how beautifully written your thesis report is, but what business problem your thesis topic can solve. The first thing you need to do when choosing a master's thesis topic is to make sure that it's aligned with your future career plans. If your thesis topic is not aligned with your career plans, then it'll probably be great as a report so that you can finish your degree, but it's not going to help you in your career. For example, if you see your career in mobile telecoms, then you need to make sure that whatever thesis topic you choose can allow you to be able to contact a mobile operator, a mobile network vendor, or anyone who works in mobile telecoms to basically sell your thesis topic to them. Alternatively, what you can also do is to look for or search for thesis topics within companies that are dealing with mobile telecoms. For example, mobile network operators, mobile network vendors, or anyone dealing with mobile telecom products and services. Now, one of the most crucial things you have to remember when choosing a master's thesis topic on any engineering subject, especially telecoms, is to make sure that the technology that you choose for your thesis is neither too mature nor too futuristic. A thesis topic, doesn't matter if it's a master's or bachelor's or even PhD, is essentially a research topic. So when a company is doing a research, they want to do it on a new technology, not a mature technology. For example, if I were to choose a master's thesis topic today in telecoms, mobile communications, I will definitely not go for anything in 4G, 4G LTE, because 4G LTE is already a mature topic and companies already have enough information on this subject. So if I wanted to do a thesis, I would look for something a little bit more advanced than 4G. On the other hand, you also want to make sure that you don't choose a topic that is too futuristic, like for example in mobile telecoms, 6G. The latest technology in mobile telecoms at the moment is 5G and a lot of developments will take place all the way till 2030 on 5G. 6G is expected to arrive around 2030 and even at that time, just like any new technology, it's going to take a number of years to mature. So if I had to choose a master's thesis topic in 2022, I would not be choosing anything on 6G because 6G would not result into any job opportunities for me in the near future. So ideally, you want to choose a master's thesis topic that is somewhere between mature and futuristic. Now, as a student, you may be wondering, how would you know whether a topic is too mature or too futuristic? In order to establish whether a topic is too mature or too futuristic, you have to first understand the market. The easiest way to understand the market is to do a job search in your field. That way you will know what technologies and what capabilities are currently in demand. Once you know the current demand, you can establish what is too futuristic and what is too mature. One key point around the thesis topic is the value. So the value that the thesis topic can add to your profile, to your CV, and the value you can add to the topic by doing your research. So first of all, you have to make sure that the thesis topic that you choose is going to add value to your CV and it's actually going to help you achieve what you want to achieve in your career. The other thing you have to be mindful of is the value you can add to the topic. So as you can imagine, if you're working for a mobile operator for your master's thesis, you would probably think that they may already have many employees with a lot of experience. So what value can you add that those employees can't? A master's thesis or bachelor's thesis or PhD thesis is essentially a research which will answer some of the questions that a company like a mobile operator is trying to answer. So the value you can add as a student is to do a comprehensive research on the topic which the employees of a company may not have time to do. 
as a student you may be closer to all the documentation around certain technologies and that way you can use your academic experience to do the research properly. And finally, the last thing you have to remember when choosing a master's thesis topic is to make sure that the topic can allow you to connect to the right people in the industry. That way, once you're done with the master's thesis topic, you may have a chance of finding a job either in that company or in the industry overall. Also, if you realize at the end of your master's thesis that the topic that you chose does not have that many job opportunities, at least if you know the contacts in the industry, they can potentially help you find a job in an interrelated area. Thanks for watching the video guys. I've written a very comprehensive post on this topic. Have a look at the link in the description below.